Welcome back to Chris RD Gymnastic Sports and Music Channel, and we welcome you all to the 10 meters platform dive boys semi final during the World University Games 2019. So, this is a replay, and World University Games 2023 is happening now, and they will have their diving on August 1 to August 5. So, we will watch for that. So, for now, let us watch the replay of this. And please do not forget to subscribe, like, and share to this channel. This is a form of sports blogging. This is not the official sports channel of the World University Games. So I need to speak here because YouTube requires it. Thank you very much for your understanding. Thank you. To begin with our first round is the man from USA. Lyle Brown Yost will have a 3.0 level of difficulty. He will do a 3 and 1 half somersault. Okay. Starting with a forward 3 and a half somersault pipe. Hmm. It will be done in the forward pike position. That's a great job for USA. Have shown their acrobatic ability even early in the morning. Strong jump, quick throw, pulls in tight, very neat on the pike. And all the divers we've seen with bent knees, small gap there, just could have closed off the pike a little bit more. He has a very good bike position there, very clean, 60.0 six score. The next man that we have is from Germany, Alexander Luby will have a 2.8 level of difficulty, reverse 2 in 1 half somersault, stack positions. That's a very good reverse 2 in 1 half somersaults in stack positions from Germany. Very good vertical lines, 57.4 for Alexander Luby of Germany. We now have here the second diver, the next diver from Japan, Yuto Araki, with 2.6 level of difficulty. He will do arm stand back, two in somersaults in tuck positions. Most of the divers here that we are watching right now are already competing in their senior career. That's a great job. Oh, they're saying just great job for Japan. So the flick off, the tuck in, and then the kick out. So when he's more confident. Great job for Japan, 46.80. His total score for his first dive. Moving on to our next diver from Singapore, Jonathan Chan. We'll have a 3.0 level of difficulty. Great job for Jonathan Chan. That is a forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in the pike position. A great execution. Jonathan Chan got 61.5 score from the judges. American, Moving on to our next diver, still from Japan, Shota Yamada. And with 3.2 level of difficulty, arm stand back, two somersaults with one and one half twist, free. That's a great handstand, no hesitations. Great job. Very clean, very clean flight from Japan. That's the hands that we just very beautiful indeed. This thing is enormous. Great job. He got 76.8 total score in that first dive. Moving on to our next divers from Armenia, Vladimir Harutian. We'll have a 3.2 level of difficulty. He will do an inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position.
That is a very clean dive from Vladimir Hadurutian of Armenia. Vladimir got 64.0 score in his first dive. Moving on for our next diver is a diver from Korea, Jay Wok Shin. In his round 1, he will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in ward 3 in the one half somersaults in tuck position. Jay Wok Shin. That is a good job from the man of Korea. Great job, but a little bit some arcing. He got 60.8 score here for the judges. A little bit of arcing, he said to his coach. Next man from we have is from Italy, Antonio Volpe. Antonio Volpe is now competing for seniors. 3.2 level of difficulty, and he will do a back two in one half somersaults when in one half. Twisting with in pike positions. Great job from Italy. Beautiful. You are watching the replay of the 2019 World University Games that happened in Napoli, Italy. He got 59.2 score here for Antonio Volpe. From USA, we have Jacob Alan Seiler. We'll have a 3.3 level of difficulty and we'll do a forward 2 and 1 half somersaults with double twisting in pike position. Great job! Such a great job from the man of USA. Early with the twist here, double twist, and then using the strength to pull forward, or they can do what's called a double out. Jacob Allen Seeler got 64.35 score from the judges. Great job. Moving on is from China, Lisi Kao. We'll have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his first round. He will do an inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. Awesome job from the Chinese. They are really great in diving. Chao got 76.8 score from the judges. Great executions. Moving on is the man from Mexico, Jose Diego Baliesa Isayas. We'll have a 3.2 level of difficulty and he will do a arm stand back to double somersaults with one and one half twisting three positions. Jose Diego Baliesa Isayas is now competing for senior level. Oh, a little bit of some debating on the left from the Mexican. Great Start job, beautiful. At the right time, then gets into the twist. Flick is good, twist is good, but there, loose in the back. Yeah, it's a little bit hit a bit loose in the back. He got 62.4 score here from the judges. 6.5, 6.0 are his scores. Moving on from Canada, Ethan Pittman. Ethan Pittman will have a 3.0 level of difficulty. He will do a forward. Three and one half somersaults in pike positions. Ethan Pittman of Canada. Good dive. Beautiful What's dive. Beautiful good? dive from Ethan. A very fast spin. A good save at the end. I love his pike positions here. Pike head up on the first somersault. Second and third somersault good. Just started to go. 61.5 score from Ethan Pittman of Canada. Be fine for the first round. Moving on is the man from Russia, German Estroib. German Estroib will have a 3.0 level of difficulty, forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike position. 
Oh, that's a great job from the Russian. Great job from the Russian. 63.0 score for German is Robe. Moving on from Russia also, Igor Vnokov. Igor will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack position. Let's welcome the Russian. Oh, the attack position is amazing. It's a good execution from the Russian. Dug down with his head, just here, coming out a little early. Feet up rather than forward and down. Stayed with it. Igor got 62.4 score for the judges. 6.5, 7.0 are his scores. Moving on is from Canada. Loren Koslin Paradis will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his arm stand back in double somersaults with one and one half twisting free position that's a great job a from a Canadian and then into the twist so the technique there was good they didn't particularly like the handstand could have been even more vertical. Laurent got 64.0, 6, 7.0, 6.5, 7.0, 7.5 are his scores. Moving on from the man of Korea, Jae Gyeong Yi will have a 3.0 level of difficulty. He will do a forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike positions. Korea. That's a great job from Korea. <laughs> it's, bad. it's near to drop his speedo here. A little bit small mistakes from him. 64.5 is his score. Jae Gyeong Ji of Korea. Moving on, the man of Mexico, Andres Villarreal Tondon. To Don, he will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in over 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. Andres Villarreal, Villarreal to Don. Good job for Andres. Mexicans are really great diver. On the lineup, just reaching from the wrong part. Good spin, good tuck, touch pointed, good pike out. Andres got 68.8 score for the judges. 7.5, 7.0, 6 and a half are his scores. Man of China. Won the prelims by five points. We have here the man of China, Boeing Huang, will have a 3.2 level of difficulty and he will do an inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. So he just went 68 points. That is a very clean dive from Chinese. The tuck is good as you can see. Entry is beautiful, perfect vertical lines. He got 76.8 score from the judges here. Score after the first dive. We are now on the second round of diving. We have here the USA Live Bro Broman Yost will have a 3.4 level of difficulty. Great job for his arm stand forward in double somersaults in pike positions. The pike is beautiful. It's a little bit. He got 39.6 score for the judges. 
5.5, 5 5.570 are his scores. It's a mixed score from the judges. Moving on from Germany, Alexander Lube will have a 3.2 level of difficulty and will do an arm stand back double somersaults with one and one half twisting. Three. Awesome job from the German. Dropping very, very short. As soon as you start to drift off, you can't get the jump. Twisting below the board. Very open. Yeah, he twists uh, below the board. 38.4 are his score from the judges. 4.0, 5.0 are his scores. Moving on from the man of Japan, Yoto Araki will have a 3.0 level of difficulty and will do a back what, two and one half somersaults in back positions. Great job from Araki of Japan. Again, this is a lead up for a back three and a half of ten. So doing the right thing if he's not ready. Great job for you to Araki. He got fifty four point zero score from the judges. Moving on is the Singaporean Jonathan Chan will have a three point two level of difficulty. Inward three and one half somersaults in tack position for his second round. Please do not forget to subscribe, like, and share to this channel. Thank you. Awesome job from Jonathan Chen. The little pop up of the 10 meter double at 10, triple at seven and a half, out at six. I love his job, his diving here. 60.8 is his score. 6.5, 6.0, 7.0. His score from the judges. Moving on, the man of Japan, Shota Yamada, will have a 3.3 level of difficulty and will do a back 3.5 somersaults in tuck positions. Japan. Very lucky with the out. He jumps away from the platform. That's a great job. Kicks his feet up there just in time to reach back and get a vertical entry. Great job for the Japan here. And I love his vertical entry. He got 70.95 score. He has a good score 7.5, 6.0, 6.5 are his score from the judges. Great job, Japan. We now have here from Armenia, Vladimir Harutyan in his second dive will have a 3.0 level of difficulty. Forward, 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike position. He is now competing for the senior level. Again, you are watching the replay of the 2019 World University Games. Great job from Harutyan. That happens when the divers are not fully upright and get a quick jump. Once he's in the air, spins fast, good pike, out on the triple, sights the water, probably about a meter out too far. He got 63.0 score here from the judges, 6.5, 7.0 are his scores. We have here from Korea, Jay Wok Shin will have a 3.3 level of difficulty in his back, 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck positions. Way too late on that kick out. Great start. Oh, great job from the Korean. I love the tuck position. The revolution is good. Oh, not that perfect entry. 37.95 are. Is his score? Three and a half, or plus zero point and a half. Antonio Volpe, the man of Italy, Italian, 2.4 level of difficulty in his arm stand forward with double twisting somersaults in the pike position. Sorry, his arm stand forward, double somersaults, yeah, and pike positions. Great job for Italy, Antonio Volpe. The pike position is good, beautiful entry. With that level of difficulty. He got 52.8 score here from the judges. Because of that low level of difficulty. 
Moving on, from the USA, Jacob Allen Seiler will have a 3.3 level of difficulty, will have a back 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck positions. Jacob Allen Seiler of USA. Oh, that is amazing job from the American. Oh, the vertical line is not that perfect. He got 49.5 score here. 5 and 5 0, 4 point half, 6 point 0 are his score from the judges. Moving on for the man of e China, DG Cow. Will have a 3.3 level of difficulty in his back 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. Li Shi Cao of China. Oh, that's a good jo job from him. Let's see. The tuck position is good. Not, not that perfect vertical lines. He got 39.6 score here. 4.0, 4.5, and 3.5 are his scores from the judges. Moving on is from the Mexican, Jose Diego Valleza Isayas. We have 3.2 level of difficulty in his second round. In war 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. Jose is now competing for the senior level. Great job from the Mexican. I love his job. Very springy take off double. Eight meters triple. Out seven and a half meters. That's a beautiful entry from Mexican. What happened to him? I hope he's fine. He got 76.8 score here. Pretty good score. 8.0, 8.5, 7.5 scores from the judges. Moving on from Canada, Ethan Pittman will have a 3.3 level of difficulty in his backward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck positions. Oh, great job. Beautiful flight. The top position is good. It's just the vertical line is not that perfect. He got 54.45 scores from the judges. 6.5, 6.0, 5.0, 5 5.5 are his scores. From the Russia, German is robe. will have 3.2 level of difficulty in his arm stand. Back to somersaults. With one and one half twisting, free position. Great job, German strobe. The back hitting the water, and when you're hitting the water at 35 miles an hour, you've got to be fully looked out. The twist, and just here, it needs to tighten up in the stomach. He got 48.0 score here. Great job, German Strobe. From Russia, Igor Vnokov will have a 3.0 level of difficulty in his forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike positions. They are still very young here. Great job from Russia. Coming out at just above the three and a half meters, not much time to get the vertical entry. Yeah, he's leaning forward, dropping fast, good pike coat. Just need another half meter, meter of drop. Igor got 58.5 score here, 6.5 are his scores from the judges. Moving on from Canada, Lauren Goslin Paradis will have a 3.0 level of difficulty in his forward three and one half somersaults in pike positions. Amazing job from the Canadian. Five meter. Pike pulls in quick. Just close it off a little bit more. Saw a bit of a gap between the head and legs. 
Lauren got 61.5 scores here. 7.0, 7.5, 6.5 are his scores from the judges. Moving on is from the Korea. Jae Gyeong Yi will have a 3.2 level of difficulty and will do a forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck positions. Korea. Amazing job. <laughs> I think he <laughs> this is the second time that he loses speed though at the water. I hope he's fine. I hope he will change his speed though because he's, he's losing in <laughs> P68.8 are his is his total score, seven and a half, seven point zero are his score from the judges. I hope he needs to change his speed here. Andreas Villarreal Tudon of Mexico will have a 3.6 level of difficulty in his second dive and he will do a 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike positions. Awesome job! Awesome job from the Mexican. Was able to pull it around. Fast spin here. Just need to close off that pike a little bit more. Get the chin closer to the well, knees. It's just down. the vertical line is not that perfect. He got 66.6 6 score. Total score here six and a half. Six pike six point zero are his scores from the judges. Moving on for the China, bro. Bowen Huang will have a 3.4 level of difficulty in his reverse 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck positions from China in his second dive. Bowen Huang. Great job for Bowen Huang of China. And it was good for semi finals. Double at board level, triple at 6 meters. Very clean dive from China. He got 86.7 score here. Great job for Bowen Huang. The classified results after the second dive. Moving on now for our third round from USA. Lyle Broman Yost <laughs> will have a 2.9 level of difficulty, and USA will have a backward 2 and 1 half somersaults in pike position. Lyle, bro, man, Yost. That's a great job. This is a great job from the USA. Great competitor of the Chinese divers. Great job for the USA. 52.2 score from the judges. Total score 6.5, 6.0 scores from the judges. Alexander Luby will have a 3.0 level of difficulty here. Good job from the German. One dive in the sixties, one in the fifties. Definitely needs to try and get in the high sixties for chance for the top twelve. Good pipe position there. State coming out, arms dropped in front of his face. Should go sixty points. Fifty four point zero are his this is his total score, 6.0, 5.5, 6.5 is his score from the judges. Moving on to Japan. Yoto Araki will have a 3.1 level of difficulty. Yoto Araki will have a reverse 2 and 1 half somersaults in tuck positions. Uh, he's on 5 meter. He is not in the 10 meter platform. He will do it in the 5 meter. Again, third of his lead up dives using the semi final. Good job. Good job for him. It's a springier start, a little faster arm swing. We'll try here. 
you don't get the start right, the legs take a long time to Yeah, the vertical line is a little bit problematic. Yoto got 58.9 score here. Moving on, is the man from Singapore, Jonathan Chan, will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his arm stand back to double somersaults in one and one half twisting three positions. Oops, a little bit struggle with his handstand. Good job, Singapore. Jonathan got 57.6 score here. 6.5, 6.0 are his total scores from the judges. Moving on, transfer the Japanese, Shota Yamada will have a 3.2 level of difficulty and he will do an inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions from Japan. That's a good job for Japan. Uh, was low to the water. Again, start making sure not too close to the board. Just gets a little lean back. I love his vertical lines there. He got 67.2 score. Total score 7.0, 7.5, 6.5 are his scores from the judges. We have now here from Armenia, Vladimir Haruchan will have a 3.6 level of difficulty and he will do a back. Three and one half somersaults in pike positions from Armenia. Again in the pike position, three point six. Good job for the Armenian here. Not that perfect pike positions. Great job, great entry. You got 46.8 score here. Moving on now is Jay Wok Shin of Korea will have 3.4 level of difficulty and he will do a reverse 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions from Korea. Oh, great job from Korea, but there's a little bit um, some problem in the form. Tuck position is good. Yeah, there was a leg separation upon the entry. He got 45.9 score here. Because of that leg separation, it will have a deduction of his scores. Moving on, it's Antonio Volpi of Italy. We'll have 2.8 level of difficulty. Reverse 2 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. He is fighting here in a very safe place. Antonio Volpi is now competing for the senior. Good job for Antonio Volpi there. Just get into the high 50s. Just a little loose after he kicks. Fine here. Spotting. Kick. Not holding the stomach tight as he reaches back. Just seeing. Good job. I love his dive there. 51.8 total score. 6.5, 6.0 are his scores on the judges. Moving on from USA, Jacob Island Siler will have a 3.3 level of difficulty in his arm stand, back three triple somersaults in tuck positions. Jacob Al Island Siler of USA. Good start. Got the bend of the arms and the flick of the feet. The coordination into the start is good here. Fast spin. Feels comfortable, but kicks too late. He got 37.95 score. Total score. Three and a half, four and a half, four point zero. His scores from the judges. Moving on is from the China. Li Ji Kao. 
will have a 3.4 level of difficulty in his somersaults in tuck positions. Those great job for the third reverse three and a half somersaults. And a great start. Now, because he finishes so high, he gets a strong kick. He's locked out at this point, squeezes his ears, and drags all the water down. Very great entry. 81.6 his total score. Great job. 8.0, 8.5, 7.0 from the judges. He's on a comeback. We now have you here, Jose Jacob. Baliesa Isayas of Mexico will do a back three and one half somersaults in tuck positions. Good job for Mexican Jago. Three and a half. The entry is beautiful. I love his dive there. Jago got 74.25 total score. Seven and a half, seven and a half scores from the judges. From Canada, Ethan Pittman will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his arm stand back double somersaults and one and one half twisting three positions. Getting a bit of ground and move away from that 11th spot. Oh, wobbly on the arm stand. Let's show a straight arm stand. He's not there yet. There he is. Good job. It's a beautiful dive. Smashy, but with the up and down of the handstand, that really drains you. And your arms will feel wooden. Not particularly a springy jump. Yes, that's a tipping job. 62.4 total score from the judges. 6.5, 7.0 total are his scores from the judges. From Russia, German strobe, 3.2 level of difficulty. The Russian will do an inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. From Russia, German strobe. Good job for Russia. Good job for Russia. 76.8 scores here. 8.0, 7.5 are his given scores for the judges. Moving on now from the Russia. Igor Vnokov will have a 3.3 level of difficulty. In his back three and one half somersaults in tuck positions. Igor Vnokov of Russia. He is now competing as a senior level. You are still watching the replay of the 2019 World University Games. A little bit arcing during his entry. He got 69.3 score here. 7.5, 7.0, 6.5 scores from the judges. Moving on from Canada, Laurent Goslin Paradis will have a 3.3 level of difficulty and he will do a back 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck positions. From Canada, Laurent Goslin Paradis. Good job for the Canadian. Head goes back, arms out of line. This is fine. But here the kick, chest lifts up, see the head go back for a moment, and then line. He got 59.4 score here. 6.5, 7.0, 5.5 scores on the judges. Moving on from Korea with 3.0 level of difficulty, reverse 3 and 1 half somersaults. I hope he changed his speed though. He's keep on <laughs> dropping his speedos here. Yeah. 
Good oh, job. Just for me. <laughs> I still I don't like Dunn's <laughs> change his speed though. Scoots off the board. Kicks down. Great job down. for Korean. You got 69 points zero score here. Jake Yong Yi. Moving on is the Mexican, Andres Villarreal to Don. We'll have a 3.5 3 level of difficulty and he will do a arm stand back 3 pole somersaults in pike position. Andres Villarreal to Don of Mexico. Well, I've got the flick off. Great job from the Mexican. So you see the arms bend and the legs flick. That creates the somersault here. Not that perfect Just pike. Too late. I don't think he saw mm, spot. The entry is a little bit problematic. 47.25 scores from the total score. 4.5, 4.0, 5.0 scores from the judges. So quite a few misses. Yeah, you can see in round three. Quite a few misses in the round three. Moving on is the Chinese. Bao and Huang will have a 3.5 level of difficulty in his arm stand back three pole somersaults in pike position. Pike, so same dive as the Mexican. Bao and Huang. Oh, this is a good dive, beautiful dive for the Bao and Huang. Oh, some a little bit of. Uh, <laughs> Problem his uh, vertical lines. You get 42.0 score here, 4.0, three and a half scores on the judges. Scores and ranking after the third round. Moving on now on the fourth round. We have here from USA. So we're halfway through the competition of the men's 10 meter semi-finals competition. Yeah, we are now in the halfway of the competitions. Lai Bowman Yos of USA will have a 2.8 level of difficulty in his fourth round and he will do a reverse double in one half somersaults in tack position. You are still watching the 2019 World University Games replay. Please don't forget to subscribe, like and share to this channel. Thank you. Good job for the USA. Beautiful jump for the USA here. Kicks too early and then doesn't even try to pull it around. He thinks he's got it right. He hangs there with his hands on his legs forever. Great job for the USA. That's lack of experience for me. So the American high school has got so far a 60. Lowest is 39. Last round has got 52 points. Waiting for his scores. A little bit taking time. It's going to be a low score. He got 50 point poor scores here. For total score: 6.0, five and a half scores from the judges. Third low score. Moving on, to the German Alexander Lube. Will have a difficulty of 3.2 and he will do an inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions. Oh, good oh, job for the German. Of any chance for him. Throwing down at this point, just comes out too late and the legs kick over. 43 20 and that's. For Moving on now, so our next diver is from Japan, Yoto Araki will have a 3.0 level of difficulty and will do a forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike positions, Yoto Araki of Japan. Good dive. Very great, very great and beautiful dive from the Japan. He's very sharp here, quickly into the pike, the pike looks good, no bent knees. Good job, great entry and great vertical line. 72.0 total score, 
8.5 scores from the judges. Moving on is the Singaporean Jonathan Chan. Will have a 2.8 level of difficulty in his fourth dive, reverse two and one half somersaults in top positions. It's a dive that he will do. Jonathan Chan of Singapore. He'll be using it in the final if he gets through. Oh, oh, there's a little bit problem with the vertical lines. A little too much arcing. That's it. Oh my god, I hope he is fine. He's just smiling. 9.8 scores on the judges. <laughs> it's a missed dive because he missed his scores here. We now have here from Japan, Shota Yamada will have a 3.0 level of difficulty in his forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in 5 positions. Good job! Beautiful dive for Shota Yamada of Japan. Judder on the end of the diving board. Nope, he's fine. A little open here in the pike. When your pike is open and spinning like that, it's very hard to play. Great job for Shota Yamada. He got 63.0 score here. 7.5, 7.0 scores on the judges. Shot, we now have here from Armenia, the next diver, Vladimir Haruchan. Spot. Stand back, double one and a half. Good job for Vladimir Rutyan of Armenia. Oh, a little bit problematic with his vertical line. 68.8 scores from the total score. 7.5, 6.0, 8.0, 6.5 scores from the judges. It's a mixed decision. Moving on, it's from Korea. Jay Wok Shin, 3.6 level of difficulty. And he will do a arm stand back double somersaults with two and one half twisting three positions jay wok shin of korea there's a strong jump and flick off those arms and with those legs oh it's too much rotation so oh. when he piped down he couldn't stop it a little over slightly over twisted the announcer says it's a too much rotation Two and a half twist. Yeah, problem problem with the vertical lines. Forty six point eight scores. Four and a half, four and a half, four point zero scores from the judges. Antonio Volpe of Italy. Antonio Volpe will have a three point three level of difficulty, and he will do a back three and one half somersaults in tuck positions. Antonio Volpe of Italy. You are watching the replay of the 2019 World University Games five years ago. Most of them are already competing for seniors. Oh, there's a problem with the vertical lines, like separations also. But beautiful dive. That's it. <laughs> I hope it's fine. 28.05 score. Very low. <laughs> a little bit of missed dive there. A little bit. Jacob Alan Seiler of USA. 3.4 level of difficulty in his dive. Is it, is it in front of him? Reverse three and a half. That's a very good reverse three and a half somersaults in the top positions. USA are really great divers. I love his dive there. 62.9 total scores on the judges. 6.5, 6.0 scores on the judges. Moving on from China. Li Shi Kao will three, have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his arm stand back double somersaults in and one and one half twisting three positions. Fifth, not first. Arm stand back double one and a half twist. Great job from the Chinese. Just doesn't seem to be completely on form in the semi-final. Just a sloppy flicking off. 
A little bit sloppy there. 64.0 score from the judges. 6.5, 7.0. We'll now have here Jose Diego Bagiesa Esayas of Mexico. We'll have a 3.0 level of difficulty and he will do a forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike position. Jose Diego Bagiesa Esayas of Mexico. Good job and brilliant job for the Mexican. Now he is uh, competing for the senior and he's making a good name in the senior diving. He got 72.0 score here. 8.0, 7.0 scores on the judges. Moving on, it's from Canada. Ethan Pittman will have a 3.4 level of difficulty and will do a reverse 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck positions. Ethan Pittman of Canada. Oh, just a little bit. Let's see, there's some a little bit problem in his vertical lines. The entry is not that beautiful, but it's fine. 35.7 score here. Three and a half are his judges' scores. Moving on is the Russian. German Strobe will have a 3.3 level of difficulty and will do a back. Three and one half somersaults in tuck positions. German strobe of Russia. Oh, a little bit of leaning to the sideward, but it's fine. Very beautiful dive. Squeezing his head in. I don't think he saw anything. He got 61.05 scores on the judges. Total scores 6.5, 5.5 individual scores from the judges. From Russia, Vnokov will have a 3.4 level of difficulty in his reverse 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. Great job from Russian Igor Vnukov. Igor got 59.5 scores here. 5.5, 6.0, 5.0 scores from the judges. Moving on is from Canada. Lauren Gosselin Paradis will have a 3.2 level of difficulty and will do an inward. Three and one half somersaults in tuck position. Beautiful, beautiful entry. The vertical line is good also. Spins are beautiful. Indeed, it's a perfect dive. You got 68 points score here, total score. 7.5, 7.0, 6.5 scores on the judges. Moving on is the Korean, Jae Gyeong Yi. 3.3 level of difficulty for the Korean. He will do a back 3 and 1 half somersaults in tuck position. It's quite relaxed. Oh, uh, was very relaxed. Too relaxed, in fact, on the kick up. I think there's a problem in his dive there. Yeah. Seventy-eight point zero five score. I think he is having a problem now in his back. Two and a half, four point zero, three point zero. <laughs> Scores from the judges. I hope he's fine. Mexican Andreas Villarreal Todon will have a 3.4 level of difficulty in his fourth dive and he will do a reverse three and one half somersaults in tuck positions. Andres Villarreal Todon of Mexico.
Good time. That's a good job for Andres to Don of Mexico. Great entry. Beautiful lines. Tack position is good and the revolution is amazing. It's a good dive. 78.2 scores from the total score. 8.0, 7.5 scores from the judges. Moving on is from the China. Bowen Huang, 3.6 level of difficulty and he will do a back. 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike positions. Bowen Huang of China. Good job for Bowen Huang. But there's a little bit problem with the pike positions, not straight pike legs. We'll have some deductions in the form or executions. Very hot summer there. Moving on is... Um, no, he's not Boeing. <laughs> okay, he got 75.6 total score. The scores and um, ranking after the fourth dive. Moving on now for the fifth round, we have here from USA, Lyle Brauman, Bowman Yoss will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions. Please do not forget to subscribe, like, and share to this channel. And you are, we are watching the replay of the 2019 World University Games that happened in Napoli, Italy. Thank you very much for the support. This is a blogging. Thank you very much. Um, World University Games 2023 is happening now. He got 62.4 score here. And the diving will be on August 1 to August 5, 2023. Alexander Lube of Germany will have a 3.0 level of difficulty in his fifth dive. Mm, a little bit some mistakes there in his back three in one half somersaults in tack positions. The revolution is good. It's just the entry arcing is imminent. Got forty point five scores here. Moving on is from Japan. Yoto Araki will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions from Japan. Good job for Yoto Araki of Japan. Just hips pushing back. Feet could be a little bit more pointed. Did go over, but he drew a little splash down. Japan got 67.2 score here. Yoto Araki. 7.0, 6.5 are his scores on the judges. Moving on is the Singaporean. In his fifth dive, Jonathan Chan will have a 3.3 level of difficulty. In his back, 3.5 somersaults in top positions. Jonathan Chan of Singapore. Well, some leg separation there, but it's a very good dive. And then drifting over on the kick out. So there's the drift away, open top, kicks a little lay. Great job. Jonah Chan, Chan got 49.5 scores here. 5.0, 4 and half scores from the judges. From Japan. Shota Yamada, difficulty of 2.8 in his reverse 2 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions. Shota Yamada of Japan. Good job, good dive for Shota Yamada. Oh. He got 60.2 scores here, total scores. 7.5, 6.0, 7.5, 7.0 scores from the judges. From Armenia, Vladimir Harutyan, his fifth dive will have a 3.4 level of difficulty in the reverse, 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions. Vladimir Harutyan of Armenia. 
calling it on me. Good job for Armenia there. Not the springiest diver off the platform. Yeah, very wide with the arms before pulling into the tuck. Tries to kick up. Does a hard pull on the end. Vladimir got 61.2 score here. 6.0, 6.5, 5.5 scores from the judges. Second round. Moving on is from Korea. Korea got 1,500. Korea will have a 3.6 level of difficulty in his back 2 and one half somersaults with 2 and one half twisting pike positions. Jay Wok Shin of Korea. Good job for the Korean here. I just love his scores, his dives here. Korea got a pretty good score, 63.0 scores from the judges, 6.0 and a good score from the judges. Antonio Volpe of Italy will have a 3.2 level of difficulty and he will do a inward 3 and one half somersaults in tack positions. Antonio Volpe of Italy. Looking back, Loop of Germany, who's in 15th, only scored 40 points. So, Lopez has a chance maybe at least to get to 14th place and then maybe pick up even further on the last round, getting the chance into the top 12. Good job for Antonio Volpe. I love this dive there. Not enough jump at the start, slow spinning. Yeah, so a little bit. Um, not enough jump from the start. A little bit problem with the vertical line, but it's a very good dive. Support 8.0 scores from Antonio Volpe. 5.0 and 4.0 scores from the judges. Moving on, it's from USA. Jacob Alan Seiler will have a 3.2 level of difficulty. Jacob will do an inward 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions. After the third round dive, this number 3 and a half. Good like job for Jacob right Allen Seiler of USA. Can get very, very close there. I wonder if it put him off because he just stays in the tuck too long. Oh, Sometimes. some problem with the vertical lines and in his entry. 41.6 is scored, that's why. 4.0, 4 and half are his individual scores from the judges. From China, we have Li Shi Kao. 3.7 level of difficulty. Very high, ladies and gentlemen. Forward, four and one half somersaults in tuck position. This is a very challenging dive. Four and a half tuck. <laughs> he bites oh. out of it. Wrong move. It just, uh, a little bit, let's see. So high. But it's a good, beautiful dive. The pack is good. Oh, the vertical line is not that perfect, but it's a good dive. 61.05 scores, total score. Five and a half, six and a half, five point zero scores from the judges. Moving on is from Mexico. Jose Diego Baliesa Isayas will have a three point four level of difficulty with three and one half somersaults in track positions. Good job, good job for the Mexican. The entry is beautiful, he has a good vertical line. So said Diego Valleza Isaias got 61.2 total score, 5.5, 7.0, 6.0 scores from the judges. Moving on is Ethan Pittman of Canada. We'll have a 3.2 level of difficulty. In his inward three and one half somersaults in tuck positions, Ethan Pittman of Canada. Good job for Very Ethan Pittman entry. there. I love his dive. Down on the pike. Uh, not particularly fast at this point. 
pipes out early, stays in the pipe, pulls the diver out. Good entry. He got a good entry there. 62.4 score for Ethan Pittman. 6.5, 7.0 scores from the judges. Moving on from Russia, German Strobe will have 3.4 level of difficulty in his reverse 3 and 1 half somersaults in tack positions. Let us welcome from Russia, German Strobe. Good job oh, for German Strobe of Russia. Meter off the water. You expect him to go flat, and this happens on the end. Incredible. <laughs> he got 76.5 scores on the judges. 7.0, 7 and a half, 8.0 the individual scores. From Russia, we have here Igor Vnoko will have 3.3 level of difficulty in his round 5 with arm stand back 3 and 1. Triple somersaults in tuck positions. It's a tough way to go to the handstand. Shows how strong you have to be, both in the arms and the stomach. That's a good well, job from the Russian, the but there's a little bit problem with the form in his entry. Just here, flicks down. Yeah, he's under the ball. Evolution is good. He kick up a bit more here. A little bit of arcing Just there. He got 59.4 score here so for Igor Vinokov of Russia. Moving on now, it's from Canada, Laurent Gosilin Paradis. We'll have a 3.4 level of difficulty. In his reverse three and one half somersaults in tack positions. Lauren Gosselin Paradis. Amazing job from the Canadian. It was very short, so it's a miss. Because yeah, it's a miss dive, as they said. Tack. Oh, the vertical line is not that perfect. He got 56.1 scored here. Five and a half. 5.5, 5.0 scores on the judges. Moving on is from Korea. Jae Gyeong Yi will have a difficulty of 3.2 and he will do a arm stand back 2 and some double somersaults with 1 and 1 half twisting in 3 positions. From Korea, Jae Gyeong Yi. Score 28 points. Tucking up to the arm stand. Back 2.5, 1.5 twist. Uh, that is a perfect dive from Korea. <laughs> I think he needs to change his speed though. He, he keeps on dropping his speed though. The pipe loses the feet. So a few points will be deducted for that. He got 64.0 score here. Moving on is from Mexico. Andrea Villarreal to Don. And he will have a 3.6 level of difficulty in his Back to and one half somersaults with double and one half twisting in pike positions. Yeah, that is good. a good dive. Technique. He got the right start, didn't go into the twist too soon, gets the jump, then the two and a half twist, strong on the pull in into the pipe for the last two and a half. He got a very strong dive here. 75.6 is his total score. 7.0, 6.5, 7.0 scores from the judges. Moving on is from China. Bovin Huang will have a 3.7 level of difficulty in his forward four and one half somersaults in top position. Very difficult dive, ladies and gentlemen. From China, Bo Wen Huang. Maximum score 111. We get 10 on it. Oh, very great job. Very great job from China. But being in second place, it's not a problem. Yeah, again, don't like the tarp. Feet flat. 
we got 55.5 score here. 5.0, 5.5, four and a half scores so from the judges. Why very the standing after the fifth round? Moving on now for the sixth and final round for the semifinals of the 2019 World University Games. From USA, Lyle Bowman Yost, 3.3 level of difficulty. Good job for the USA. That's the forward two and one half somersaults with double twisting in the pike positions. Great job for the USA. Lyle Bowman Yost. He got a good score here, 64.35. Moving on it's from Germany, Alexander Lub. Alexander Lub will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his back. Three and two and one half somersault, one and one half twisting, five positions. Very good job. That's a good finish for his two and one half somersaults with one and one half twisting in five positions. He got 60.8 total score here. Six and a half, six point zero scores from the judges. Moving on from Japan, Yoto Araki will have a three point two level of difficulty, and he will do a um, back two and one half somersaults in with one and one half twisting pike positions. Oh, he lifted his chest up on the edge. Oh. Such a shame. But it's just a good dive, very beautiful dive from Yoto Araki. One half twist, pulls forward, but just here, lifts his chest up. I love his dive there. He got 48.0 scores from the judges. 5.5, 5.0, 4.5, 4.0 scores from the judges. Moving on from Singapore. We have here Jonathan Chan. In his last dive, Jonathan Chan will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his back two and one half somersaults with one and one half twisting in pike positions. That is a good job for Jonathan Chan. You sort of lose all your energy when you miss a dive so badly. And you think there's no chance of making the final. That's, that's a good final job. Score. He got 57.6 score here. 6.0, 6.5, 5.5 scores from the judges. Yamada of Japan. Shota Yamada of Japan will have a 3.3 level of difficulty in his last dive. And he will do a back one and one half somersaults with three and one half twisting in three positions. Scored 64. <laughs> what is doing with his tongue? So back one and a half, three and a half twists. Not seen this dive um, in the semi finals before. So the key here is not to get too much rotation. You need to do a good job here. You feel like you twist forever. Oh, he lost Whoa. It. But that's a good job for this fan. Two, three, there. Pulls his head down. Feet come apart. Oh, and then drops that's short. So that's a miss. And he was in 12th place. He got 62.7 score here. Very great job for Shota Yamada. And he may be the lucky diver with the 400 points. He got... We now have here from Armenia, Vladimir Haruchan. 3.6 level of difficulty in his back two and one half somersaults. With two and one half twisting in pike positions. Armenia, Vladimir Harutian. Big one, three, six. Good job. That is a great job from Armenia. I love his last dive here. Somersault. You need to be able to get into a deep point. So twist is good, but here coming around two and a half, can't really pull it. Oh, the pike positions. Um, the form is not that good. You got fifty-four point zero score here. Five point zero, five and a half, four and a half. Moving on is from Korea, Jay Wokshin will have a 3.0 level of difficulty. Shin currently in 15th place. 
Good job for Jay Lokshin. Good job for Jay Lokshin. Jay Wokshin got 63.0 score here, 7.0 are his individual scores and judges. Antonio Volpe of Italy, the legend Antonio Volpe will have a 3.0 level of difficulty and he will do a forward 3 and 1 half somersaults in pike position. Final dive, forward 3 and a half somersaults pike. Again, not much chance really of the Italian making it into the top 12 at this point. Not even sure mathematically with tens it would be possible. But let's put on a good performance. Pretty already with two medals in the men's competitions. Great job, great job for the man of Italy. Ten degrees short of vertical. I love the vertical lines there. The if you can see, the revolution is good in spike positions. Good entry. He got 52.5 score here. Fair score for that dive. 5.5, 6.0 on the individual scores and the judges. Congratulations, Antonio Volpe. Moving on to our diver from USA, Jacob Alan Seiler. will have a 3.0 level of difficulty for his sixth dive. Forward 3 and 1 half summer souls in pike positions. Good job for USA. Coming quickly up to the top. There's the throw. Good spin. Comes around the triple, sights the water. The revolution is good and the entry is beautiful. Very good vertical lines. 7.5 total score. We have your Lishi Cow of China. Okay, oh. Dropped back to sixth place after the last round. Back two and a half, one and a half. That's a final dive. Should be safe for the followers in sixth. Yeah, Good job way. for China. So we will be seeing KO in the finals this afternoon. One and a half twist, performed perfectly. Very strong going back into the play. Great like job. He got 72.0 score here. 7.5, 7.5, 8.0. Seven 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 Moving on is Jose Diego Ballesa, Isaias of Mexico. He will have a 3.2 level of difficulty for his last dive. Back two and one half somersaults with one and one half twisting in pike positions. Jego, Jose Jego Ballesa Isayas of Mexico. Ah, oh, great final Great dive. job, great final dive for Jose Jego Ballesa of Mexico. And he was so high, comes around, looks, takes your time, line up, and punch to the water. Another great dive. Great dive for Sejago. He got 72 points here. Scores in the total score. From Canada, for his sixth dive, Ethan Pittman will have a 3.2 level of difficulty and he will do a back two and one half somersaults with one and one half twisting in pike positions. Ethan Pittman. Good job, Ethan Pittman of Canada. Back two and a half, one and a half twist. And he gets the vertical entry. Could he be safe? He got 65 point. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> he is near to have an accident there. 65 point to score here. Great job for Ethan Pittman. German Strobe of Russia will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his last dive. And he will do a back two and one half somersaults with one and one half twisting in pike positions. Strobe is done. Very well, currently in 5th place. Big move up from 8th on the last dive. Oh, that was all over the place. Lent away from the diving board as he comes round. Over twist here. Can't hold it. Yeah, I said that it was an over twisting. He got 56 points here, score here. 6 points here, 5 and a half are his scores from the judges. The Russian will be in the final. The next Russians that we have is Igor Vnokov will have a 3.2 level of difficulty for his last dive. We'll do a back two and one half somersaults with one and one half twisting in pike positions. Two and a half, one and a half to finish. Oh, 
Well, That's a good his job. That's a little bit of leg separation upon his entry. There's the one and a half twist, no wobble. Good pike. Very good pike there. But that's a pike. Great pike. 59.2, his total score. 6.5, 7.0, 6.0, scores on the judges. Moving on from Canada, Laurent Gosselin Paredes will have a 3.2 level of difficulty. He will do a back 1 and 1 half somersaults with 1 and 1 half twisting in pike positions. Laurent Gosselin Paredes of Canada. Good job, good job for Laurent Gosselin Paredes. Good pike. And wasn't particularly high, but got the vertical He will get a 64.0 score. He got 64.0 total score there. Moving on, from Korea, Jae Gyeong Yi. I hope he will not drop his speed now. He will have a 3.2 level of difficulty. Back to in one half somersaults with one in one half twisting. In pike position. 28 points. Not been able to get into the 70s. Same dive to finish, that twister. Oh, he's lost his feet and he oh, got it together. And the good that entry. That is well, a lot going very on good dive. Again, he dropped his speed though. <laughs> I hope he is fine. I know. I hope he will change his speed now <laughs> for the next competitions. He got sixty four points here. Score here. Might be enough. Two divers still to go. Real in fourth. Forward four and a half somersaults. It's going to measure out. Along the platform, just to make sure he's got it Again, right. Again, we are watching the World University Games 2019 replay. And now, we uh, World University Games is happening now in, in China. And the diving will be on August 1 to August 5, 2023. Thank you very much. Please do not forget to subscribe, like, and share to this channel. Thank you very much for the support. Good job! That's a great revolution in stock positions, and the entry is beautiful. Pike position is good also. Not quite up right the end. Fast there's not too much splash of water, so. although there's some problem with the vertical end, but it's fine. 62.9 total score for the judges. 5.5, 6.0, Huang Bowen of China will have a 3.2 level of difficulty in his back. Two and one half somersaults with one and one half twisting in pipe positions. That secures a place for him in the final. Good yes. job for Bowen Huang. That is a very clean dive for Bowen Huang. Lovely twist. The technique is so correct. And a good entry to finish. Yes, yeah, very correct uh, technique there. 78.4 score from the judges. 8.0, 9.0 individual scores. The blue ribbon event, the men's 10 meter platform. It's been decided. And the final standings. Just confirm the top 12 places, those divers that will be going through, and the semi finals all completed. The finals will be up. Next. These are now the final standing after the sixth round. Mexico in the first place, Jose Diego Bayasayas. Second place is China, Bowen Huang. Third place for Japan, Shota Yamada. Fourth place for Mexico, Andreas Villarreal Todon. Fifth place for China, Li Chekau. Sixth place for Russia, German Strove. Seventh place for Canada, Lauren Gosselin Paridis. Eighth place for Russia, Igor Vnokov. The top 12 will be competing for the finals. Thank you very much for watching this channel. And this is the replay of the 2019 World University Games. Thank you very much and God bless you all. Jonathan Chan of Singapore finishes on the 16th place. And Vladimir Ruchan of Armenia on the 10th place. Thank you very much. God bless you all.